Welcome back to Bally Spring, Episode 8, Farm Construction and Selling Milk, with me, this gaming man. Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode here on Bally Spring. Sorry I wasn't around last week, um, I wasn't very well. Some of you may know, I was ended up in hospital. Um, everything's, everything's all good now, thank God. Uh, pretty scary for a few hours, but um, yeah, I'm all good now. Um, it was a suspected appendicitis, but it was all the... Um, it was all the um, tissue around the appendix was all inflamed and angry. Very painful. Really, yeah. I've got quite a strong, strong high uh, pain threshold, but that was like up there. Bit crazy. Anyway, enough of my woes and tripulations. Cows are doing well. I've just fed them. Um, they've got a little bit of muck in there which need coming out so I'll have to do that I've also been selling off some of our silage as well that's all been uh, taken back we've got about 100,000 uh, litres left in the silage clamp as you can see over there it's it's all gone down I'm just going to have a quick look and show you it's gone down quite a bit it's about 100,000 litres in there or just under so we're going to sell the rest of that off at some point I'll probably do a few loads each day. Uh, cows, obviously, all good. Look, like I say, a little bit of manure st still in there. Um, and over here, um, we last episode we were making firewood out of some of the trees we're taking out. Um, we've got a big area to put some trees in and stuff. Uh, there's the firewood that we've made, um, and we're going to put some put some apple trees over this side somewhere uh, is that is the plan we're also going to put a bit of a track in so if we can put the track in now we'll get that sorted out we'll go into the landscaping mode and we'll just stick in a gravel track just finding the gravel texture now over here on the end somewhere uh, there it is it's just gone past it there it is so I'm just going to stick this gravel texture in. I'll just put a, a rough line on the outside. Out here and over towards the um, firewood uh, making production. And I'll put another line on the other side so we can just roughly mark out our path. It's kind of difficult with the snow down. Can't really see where I'm, uh, where I'm going properly. So just put a bit more gravel in round here. Don't want to go too big with the uh, with the paintbrush because they end up getting a bit out of control. So yeah, I'm we'll just filling these bits over it, and then we'll go and fill the middle section. Is that going to be wide enough? Can't go any further that way for some reason. Anyway, we'll just go and paint this in with the uh, landscaping tool. Get rid of all these bits of grass. It's going to be a full gravel path. Lovely, just a few more bits at the other end. Just square this other side up on the right hand side, I think. I don't want to go too far in, but just square it up a bit. Probably about there. Make it a little bit wider here, because it's got a bit narrow here. bit wider at the end here. How's that looking? Might be about there. So these are the apple trees we're going to put in. Um, I think we're going to put four in I think. Might be all right over there over the um, manure separator thing. Should be all right. I'll stick on there. Let's put another one about, about here I think. Bad air on the edge. I'll stick another one over here. I'll put four in, like I say. Um, the money obviously has gone up because we uh, sold all the silage from the last episode. Um, I think we might put a bit of a track in, I think. They look very smart. Uh, might have to put the old... Um, put the old... Um, interactive markers on for a second so we can just have a quick look 
So I think I think the do these need do these needs manure as well, or they just need water, I can't remember. I'm just gonna put a bit of a path in anyway, put a bit of a forest ground path in. Over to all these little areas. So we can see where we're going. See where like the pallets need to spawn and stuff. Probably could have put them put them around the other way maybe. Don't know, we'll see. We'll see. Just clear all this up here. Get rid of all the grass. Get rid of that as well. Make a bit more. How's that looking? He's a bit bigger. Just so we can see where we need to go. Dog. My dog seems to be grunting as well in the background. <laughs> Sorry if you can hear her grunting away. Yeah, how's that? That's, that's quite smart. I think the. I think these are just um, just water possibly. They might need manure, but we've got loads of manure anyway, so it's not a problem. Um, let's have a quick look. See what they do need. Uh, they just need water. They just need water, that's all they need. Um, so I'll probably get maybe a greenhouse in to help use some of our uh, manure up. I'll just go and get our um, water container, which is over here. I'll use the Lamborghini to pick it up. Uh, put it on the back, I think. It's already filled up, I think. Yeah, I filled it up. Um, so yeah, I might need to get a bigger one of these possibly, um, depending on how much it needs. Might be the new in the next farm upgrade. Of course, it's a bit skiddy round here. Got a bit of understeer there, <laughs> just carried on going. So yeah, let's have a look, see how much of these are going to take. Probably a lot. So I wonder over here while that's filling up. This is quite cool, this is. I do like this mod. It's really, really cool. This is what we were up to last episode. This has been chugging away for quite a while. Um, I do like this mod. I do. So this over here has been making loads and loads and loads of firewood. Um, we've got, I think we've got four or five over in the shed over there that have moved out. So this is going well this is. Um, I think we had about just over 60,000 litres of firewood in here, of firewood, of tree wood in here. So that's going quite well. So how's this going? Is this still overloading? I think we're going to need a bigger, we need a bigger thing here I think. So it's going to need a bigger water bowser I think um, it might be it <laughs> might take us some time going back and forth with this guess I could put one on the front but even so that's going to be not massively quickly do, quick doing that. Whoa. Good if you could put water in your um, manure spreaders really for stuff like this. I mean obviously you wouldn't want to put drinking water in it but for watering plants it'd be alright. I bet PC guys have got a mod for that. that so that's that one working soon be there it's taking forever to empty out. 
yeah definitely think like a big water bowser is is needed for this job taking forever So I might put a greenhouse in here as well. Um, let's look at greenhouse over on this side maybe. On the left hand side here. Over here somewhere. Over here. Also got a bit of milk as well that we can do with selling as well. Um, we're looking here. Um, Thirty-three thousand litres of milk, nearly thirty-four thousand litres of milk. So we can sell that. We'll also need to get some fuel actually for this. I might order some. Let's order some of that now. Um, We'll do 2,000 litres of fuel in that. Cool. Skiddy is skiddy. We've just got the two back ones to do now. This one working. Save the game while we're here. Do, 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 do. I think it's that one anyway that's it's already working by the looks of it. I was hoping those would take manure because we've got an absolute stack of manure out the back of the uh, cow shed. But they won't so I think I'm going to get myself a greenhouse as well. See the big stack of manure, I've got absolutely loads of that. So I've been clearing out the um, the shrubs as well up here with the um, with the Massey Ferguson, not Massey Ferguson, with the um, class. This one over here. I found it a lot better using this, taking out the stumps and stuff. Um, it's loads better. That thing I was using the other time was a bit hit and miss. It used to be quite a good um, treat stump grinder, but like an FS, an FS18, FS19, FS19. Um, when that was, they did the original one, that was so much better to use. Whether it's the map, whether it doesn't like it with this map, some some things just don't work with some maps. I don't know. I don't know. I'm not a programmer. I'm not, I'm not a professional. Not a professional, man. Right, so we're going to put our greenhouse. I think we're going to get a little one in. I think I'll put a small one in um, production greenhouses 
We could get an olive tree in as well. Olives aren't really renowned for go growing in Ireland. <laughs> Pretty sure they're not. Um, oh, it's that side, is it? Let's pop it this way, I think. There you go. It's in like that. That'll do. I'll put a little bit of gravel around here. Put a bit of gravel in there. Landscaping paint. I just wanted to get you, show you that I was. I haven't been cheating any money in or anything like that. I've done about four or five. Four, four loads, I think, of um, in total of the um, of the silage. I think round here there's it's where we uh, grounded out the stump I think so just trying to colour it in a little bit which doesn't look like a ploughed field so that needs some water in that needs some manure in as well wowzers I think we're going to put some strawberries in we also have some wheat that we still need to sell. Um, I'm not sure what to do with the wheat because now we've got chickens. Is it worth us holding on to the wheat? I think we've got about 10,000 litres. Um, we've only got, I think it's going for about 705 pounds per li per hundred per thousand litres. Um, so I don't know if it's fully worth it at the moment. I don't know, I'll see. We need to get a Bowser obviously as well, so maybe it might be worth us getting rid of it. Maybe, I have to think, I have a think about it. You have to open up to go and have a little look inside. So, ah, oh, we need seed as well, don't we? Oh, didn't thought think about that one. That's not a problem. That's not a problem. We can sort that out. Um, switch that off for now. Uh, um, do, 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 do. I think we've got some seed over. We've got some seed in there, probably. Got a little bit of seed in there. Um, definitely got some seed in here. I've done myself on the spikes there. <laughs> right. Right, I'll get this on that. Oh, 
I do like the Merlot. Um, when I was moving the trees about, my God, it's strong. It's got a great, great load capacity. Um, I wasn't really tipping up or anything. I know I was using a weight on the back, but yeah, very strong bit of uh, bit of kit. I'll just chuck this here, I think. Is that overloading? Yeah, it is. There you go. Couldn't tell because it was uh, on the what's his name, on the bale spikes, and because when you pick up something with the bale spikes, it doesn't give you a capacity. Um, yeah, put them in there. So there's those other bits of um, firewood we made earlier in the storage. Pretty sure my manure manure forks around here. Yep. Yeah. Let's open that up. I don't think I've used this actually. Use the one on the uh, front of the um, on the front of the little massey. We've got loads of manure, so it'd be good to use it. Move this out of the way. Let's pull this out of the way. Just wanted to have a quick look to see. Uh, we could put a little bit more manure in um, and a bit more a bit more water in put a little bit more in I could always leave it outside and it should I think it might take it as and when I was kind of hoping that the old Apple trees would use that. I'm sure we can stick it out in some of our fields. We'll probably use it on our grass fields. Skidding all over the shop. Is that it? It's not allowing me to tip it there. That will do us for now then. So you've got one greenhouse in. Four apple trees. Cool. <laughs> Skidding all over the shop. There for now. So, it's all been a hype of activity down here today. Maybe we could stick some more apple trees in at some point. Um, I wonder what size water bowser we can get. Look, get something like that six thousand liters. 
you go in that point you're sort of looking at one of those I, oof, I don't want to spend that much yeah oh what we got here oh that's 10,000 and that's I might just go for something like that you know a simp a simp lizard simp um, or however you want to pronounce it what color should we go for white blue for water uh, let's go for I'll go for a blue I'm gonna buy that because that's gonna help us it might take this off for off the back I mean, we could use it to um, use both of them. Um, what we're going to go up on? up on the matty it's over over this way <laughs> all discombobulated leave that there roads are absolutely skiddy as skiddy as well when I was doing my loads earlier this morning It and away we go. The weather at the moment in real life is absolutely freezing at the moment um, where I am in the UK. I mean, I know some places are a lot colder, but it feels really cold at the moment. Um, getting a lot of like northeasterly winds coming down, a lot of the weather's coming down from the northeast. And I was always told the northeasterly winds are the coldest because it's all coming from Scandinavia and Iceland and cold places. <laughs> so Hopefully this starts melting at some point because I want to get some um, I want to get some wheat in um, That's the plan I can't plant until about February time Come on sir out the way Okay, there's our water bowser. Might be able to use that for our milk as well. We can sell our milk. Oh, multi-purpose. I think that's what we might use it for, for the time being. So we can get our milk up to the... Um, up to the uh, milking parlour. The milking parlour, the... Um, Dairy. I'll get there in a minute. Not the Ros is chasing us, I think. Move out the way, will he overtake us? <laughs> no, he'll just drive into the back of me. He might be pulling me over. No.
not going particularly quick. I do like the uh, ice and snow, or the snow falling off the tyres. It's quite a cool effect. But yeah, this is definitely going to be a lot easier to water our plants, our trees and greenhouses. Just save the game. Oh, that's hand. Oh, God, they're out everywhere today. That's <laughs> taking it straight out of that one and into this one. That's not quite what I wanted, but never mind. <laughs> Just trans. Oh god, he's hitting things now. What am I doing? Leave that there, leave that there. Properly skiddy. Well, that's that done. Get in. Oops. Skidding all over the shop. Whoa. <laughs> Jackknifing. We got it. Quite like this little area now, it's quite nice. It's going to be quite a useful uh, project that we've done here. Got apples on the trees but no leaves. Interesting concept. I think you can put like um, water bowser in and then it'll, like a water bowser, like a water tank and it'll sort itself out I think. Hey, oh, snow's melted, just like that. Oh, that's a bit better. Just me fields look a bit white with all the lime. I quite like that mod, that's, that's a good little mod. Oh, just walked into the uh, wall there. Yeah, that needs painting out, doesn't it? Uh, that bit there.
fill in all those little bits there. So that's what I was using for um, getting all the stumps out. This um, grinder thing. It's very, very good. Oh, we're going through this firewood. Or making this firewood, should I say. Um, yeah, it's all good. All gravy. Maybe we'll take take another load of not another load. We'll take a load of milk. Sell some milk today. Oopsie. We don't own the dairy or anything at the moment. Maybe it's something we could look at doing. Interesting. Maybe we could get two water bowsers on the go. Maybe it. It's got these two to do. I'll do these on these two off screen. I think. But we'll go and sell some milk. Got a few more trees we could cut down in here as well. Might clear some of those. That's that scrubbery over there out. We're gonna have loads of firewood. Um, I could have just sold the wood. Oh, there's another tree stump there. I could have just sold the wood if I wanted to. Probably made more money. But I wanted to give that mod a go and see what it was like. Um, here we go. I think we fill it up from there, don't we? Yes, we do. Yeah, I wanted to give that mod a go and see what it was like. Um... I've never used that mod before, it's the first time I've used it. And it looks quite good actually. There was another mod that was more like a factory. Um, which is, looks good. I've not used that one either. I can't remember who that one's by. I can't even remember who the, this one I'm using is by to be fair. So I believe since the update the dairy's at the top of the map. Uh, is it up here? Yes, it's there. So yes, yeah, so we'll have a little drive up to the dairy. I've not been up to the dairy yet. Don't know what the milk price is like as well. Let's have a quick look. Um, 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 um. Dairy's not the overly expensive price. It's paying a massive amount. It's the Bally Spring Mart is paying the most. But we'll take it to the dairy. Let's take it to the dairy. Might open a shop, I think, down here. could put it maybe in that new area maybe that we've just created shop for the locals we sell some of our own produce there so much so much different now that the snow has gone not skidding around all over the place for a start I do like this place, it's very picturesque this map, very nice indeed. Whee!
driving all over the shop. It's here on the left, I think. Yep, yeah, it's here on the left. Oh, way up, got collectible. We'll have that. Anything else around here? Oh, there's another one there. No, don't want to buy the dairy. I haven't got enough money for a start. We'll have the two collectibles though. Maybe we could buy this and make it a, a thing, a part of our enterprise maybe. Hmm. It's quite a big area as well for like sticking stuff as well. Quite possibly, we could have like a bottling plant up here as well, couldn't we? Oh. Um, I think that's where all the milk comes out. I think I was right with my first thought. That's where the milk comes out. Or the uh, milk produce, like cheese and things are like. There we go. Our first milk being sold. Might make a nice screenshot that might. Lovely, so we've made our money back up to roughly where we were probably before the just as we started this episode. I think that's going to be it for today. You guys have been awesome as always. I've been this gaming man, and until the next time, we shall see you soon.